Subscribe right now and hit the bell icon, or this fat spider will crawl over your face while you sleep. As we all know, animals have something that makes them stand out. For example, some have beautiful feathers or really fluffy fur. But today we're going to talk about 10 animals with the biggest horns in the world. These animals have horns like you have never seen before. So make sure to keep watching and do not miss out. Now let's begin our countdown. Number 10, Capra Ibex. The Capra Ibex are a part of the wild goat family and are found on the mountainous regions of Europe. The male Capra Ibex has long and strong horns, reaching up to the length of 40 inches. But females have short and thin horns, only measuring 13 inches in length. Not only are they fast creatures that can chase down their prey in seconds, they are also incredible at climbing great heights. Number 9. Attix. Attixes are also from the antelope family. They are also endangered, meaning it is very rare to see an attix in the wild. Their horns can grow up to 35 to 47 inches, which are absolutely huge. Imagine being stabbed by one of those horns. They are also called screw horn antelopes because of their remarkably twisted horns. They literally look like they have two massive corkscrews on the side of their head. Number eight, black buck. The black buck are from the Indian content and like to hang around warm weather and love to run in large bits of land. The horn of a male black buck looks like a V shape and can stretch out to 48 to 55 inches. That is taller than a large dog just standing up. Imagine a dog standing up on its hind legs isn't as tall as their horns. That's absolutely crazy. If I saw one of these in the wild, I know I would definitely keep running. Number seven, caribou. Caribou, also called reindeer, and are found across North America, Europe, and Asia. Unlike other species of deer family, both male and female caribou have antlers. The antlers of male caribou measure 39 inches in width and 53 inches in length. The female caribou have shorter antlers than the males. The antlers of a caribou also have many points in upper and lower parts. During the harsh winter seasons, caribou use their strong horns to dig in the snow to find food. Male caribou also use their horns to fight with rivals in mating season. They also shed their horns after mating season, and a new pair of horns will grow in the next summer season. Number six, Malflon. The Malflon comes from the wild sheep family. The male Malflon have attractive large curved horns. The horn of a male Malflon has an average length of 25 inches. The horn also grows throughout the life of a male Malflon. The male Malflons use their large horns to fight with other Malflons to attract females. Such fights are also to ensure dominance in the group. The diet of Malflons mainly includes grass and shrubs. These horned animals definitely love fighting for their women. Number five, Oryx. The Oryx are one of the largest antelope species. They are easily recognizable by their long horns and long horse-like neck. Their horns reach up to a length of 30 inches. Unlike males, female Oryx have longer and thinner horns. Oryx also use their long and sharp horns to defend against predators. They have an excellent sense of smell and can live for weeks without water, which is incredible as humans can't last longer than three days. They can also run at a speed of 35 miles per hour. Amazing animals. Number four, white rhino. White rhinos are the largest of the rhino species. They have two horns, one longer front horn and a smaller back horn. The horns of a white rhino are entirely different from the horns found in cattle and other animals. In fact, the horns of a white rhino are a special type of growth made of a structural protein called creatine. The large front horn of white rhinos has a length up to 24 inches. In some cases, the front horns of female white rhinos reach up to 59 inches. White rhinos are inhabited in South Africa. They form groups that contain up to 14 rhinos and feed exclusively on grass. If you like what you saw until now, stay with us because you will love our top three picks. And also, make sure to subscribe to Inside Tens and hit the bell icon to be up to date with our daily content. Here is our number three, Markhor. The Markhors have huge horns that grow up to 1.6 meters in length. The horns of a male Markhor are 50 centimeters longer than that of the females. Markhors inhabit within shrub forests of the high mountains. The color and length of their coats differ in accordance with the weather. During the summer, they have short reddish colored fur. In the winter, their fur grows longer and the color changes from red to gray. I'm actually jealous of this as it would save me so much money buying new jackets and coats. Number two, the Texas Longhorn. The Texas Longhorn is a breed of cattle that is known for its unusually large horns, which can extend to over 100 inches, 2.54 meters, tip to tip for cows and bulls, with the biggest horn steer measuring 127.4 inches. 
3.23 meters tip to tip. They have some of the largest horns you will see on any animal, not just cows or bulls. These animals will charge at you if angered. And trust me, you do not want to see these horns coming at you in anger. Number 1. Watusi This animal is a modern day American breed of domestic cattle. Their horns are some of the largest horns you will ever see. Honestly, you will see the horns before you see the animal in any wildlife situation. The Ankhol Watusi may be a number of different colors, but it's usually red. The horns are unusually large, with a widespread and the largest circumference found in any cattle breed according to the Guinness Book of World Records, with horns measuring 95.25 centimeters, 37.50 inches. Imagine some of these animals charging at me is making me scared. Comment below which animal horn was your favorite, and whilst you're in the comment section, subscribe to our channel like and hit that bell button to keep updated. And don't forget to check out our videos on the left and right side of your screen. See ya!